Hey everybody, it's me, Jeff, your favorite buff muscular anime guy. So I'm back in my office starting this week, so this week's Protein Kitchen is a bit different than normal. Uh, instead of experimenting with something new, I thought I'd show you guys a little bit more of what I actually do to uh, survive through the week. And that that's meal prepping. So I have a bunch of these containers. I bought them years and years ago. Um, I have like 30-something still. And they stack easy and they're, and they're not very tall. Uh, so they're perfect for my meal prepping. So I, I busted out those today for the first time in a little while. And then, like many great things in life, everything here started with a giant slab of frozen ground beef. Uh, I forgot to thaw it, so I, it, I knew it was going to be a long cook. And it was. I kind of had to just slowly scrape it off the top. Uh, ground beef is just what was on sale this week. Uh, if it's chicken, I'll get that. It's pretty much whatever meat is on clearance is what I buy. Um, but finally, after what, what felt like forever, I had what was a respectable amount of ground beef. So uh, I, I seasoned it with this. I used garlic, I used onion, I used ginger, I used black pepper. And I was out of soy sauce, so I actually had to hunt down uh, individual soy sauce packets from around my house that are like, who knows how old. Uh, also, my cat happened to be hanging under the table, so like any sane person, uh, I stopped it and I did a cat photo shoot. So we're just going to take a moment to appreciate how cute she is. Oh, I love you. Anyways, I found a few more packages of soy sauce as well. So look, there's three more now than there used to be. So I threw, uh, I also had a giant pillow of peas. That was the only veggie I had in the freezer was peas. So I threw all the seasonings on top. Those giant clumps are onion powder because I can't seem to keep onion powder not clumped. Um, I, I mixed it all up. It looks like ground beef again. Who knew? I threw in a bunch of frozen peas and I decided that wasn't enough. So I threw in a bunch more frozen peas. And then by the time they were all melted and uh, my phone switched to the greenery filter without me knowing, um, that's why it looks so good now. Uh, this is just a bunch of peas and ground beef, and it tastes real good. I threw it into the containers. They stack up all nice, and they fit right in the fridge. Look at that. You're ready to go rest of the week. Anyways, there will be uh, more of your normal Protein Kitchen experiences coming, but I'm going to do a few more like this as well. All right, have a good Sunday. Goodbye.